Well, you watch this show and it's called First Coast Living and we try to cover everything on the First Coast and, and show you some beautiful images. But uh, another place in town that has always done that for years is Void Magazine. And I'm joined now by Matt Shaw, the editor over there at Void Magazine. And uh, this is pretty cool. You guys put together a photo book. You know, we try to do visual, you know, storytelling through TV. You guys have done it for years through the magazine. Um, this year has been a challenge, but you got a photo book uh, that you, you just put out. Tell me about it. Yeah, it's something that we've wanted to do, um, at least since my time here. Um, we do, we run a photo annual every year, and it's one of our most popular issues of the year. We take uh, submissions from the community, local photographers. Um, and so we wanted, we've been wanting to do, as I said, like something more substantial, something that has a little bit more longevity instead of the magazine that comes out every month and you're, you're picking up something new every month, we wanted to do something that maybe would sit on people's coffee tables for a while. Um, something really tangible that like has a long life to it. You can flip through it over and over again. So what we did is we, we uh, kind of curated a list of 14 uh, local photographers. Uh, a lot of these people have shot editorial stuff for us or we featured them, uh, their work in the magazine before. And, um, we have a range of people from, uh, you know, street photographers, uh, fashion, lifestyle, food photography, um, and then some surf stuff as well. Um, so we kind of looked at it as like kind of a timestamp of what Northeast Florida looks like today. Um, and that's how we kind of approached uh, designing the issue and, and putting together the content for it. So we're pretty happy with how it turned out. And I've, I've seen, we're showing some images of it, and I've seen it, uh, it, it looks, uh, it's just classic. Uh, I mean, I remember growing up and, and waiting for the, those, those big magazines to come. They had the real thick and all the pictures and stuff. This thing looks, uh, this thing looks pretty cool. Um, how do people get it? Um, so we, uh, we have a, a web store. Uh, if you go to voidlive.com, you can find it in the tab there, or it's shop.voidlive.com if you want to go directly there. It'll also be available at um, some of our friends uh, and family, like local businesses around uh, Bold Bean Coffee Roasters, uh, Wild Crafters in Riverside, um, Southern Roots in Riverside and at the beach. Um, we're, we're still getting this thing out there, uh, Eraser Records in Murray Hill. Um, so it'll be around, you'll be able to see it around town. And if you wanna stop into our, uh, we have a Friday pop-up at our headquarters here in Jack's Beach, 602 Shutter Avenue. Um, you can always drop by there uh, between 11 a.m. and 6 p.m. and pick it up there. And for, for Void Magazine fans uh, like myself and, and thousands and thousands of others on the First Coast here, I know this is kind of uh, holding us over until you guys get back to printing, right? Yeah, we're, um, we'll have an issue in mid-November coming out, and then we're going to hold off until about February. So we thought that this would be a nice, uh, like I said, with the longevity and it being able to sit out on your coffee table for a while and stay in front of people, um, we thought it'd be a nice gift for the holiday, um, you know, especially people who live here or have a soft spot for the region. I think it's, uh, it's a nice gift for anybody who, who uh, values Northeast Florida as we do. You know, no doubt, brother. Uh, I'm looking forward to getting one on my coffee table again. Tell folks how to uh, easiest way to go get it. Uh, Shop.voidlive.com um, is the easiest way we can ship it to your door. Um, but just if you forget or whatever, keep your eyes peeled when you're uh, around town getting coffee or whatever, and, and you'll see it and pick it up. Beautiful, beautiful folks. Go out there and get that one. It's uh, if you like the old school feel of actually holding a, a magazine in your hands, it's better than Instagram, folks. Look at that. Way better than Instagram. Appreciate it, brother. Thanks, right. Curtis. Folks, we'll put this on the website. You can check it out again at firstcoastliving.net.